great big hello to everyone watching this. I'm Allie B. Mac, aka a dragon. Why, hello there, puny mortals. It is I, the cousin of Smaug. My name is Blaug. Now I know, I know you're here to watch what you poor fools consider entertainment, but I have been silenced for a thousand years and I will be silent no more! Hi, we- Moving on, you are watching the sixth part of my playthrough of Hellblades, and it was Sacrifice. Let's get right into the game! I am focusing. I'm literally looking. I am. Hey, do any of you want a backseat, like drivers, want to take a break for a second? Forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone, and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn, and. It would be the death of the king. Jeez, they sound like very bitter people. Tell you about the sword, Tierving. Yeah. Do we have to? I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? This goes back to the thing I was saying about mirrors earlier, where you look into the mirror and it, and because they were always metal, like, well, not always, but because the Celtics didn't have mirrors like we did, it was just shiny, shiny metal, that all of the images were weird and distorted. So, very so ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspired to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes, and it forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. <sighs> Don't go in then. Go in. You have to go in. Take the torch. It's too dark. Hundred percent take the torch. Be careful. You have to be able to see. So this is Dillian's burial mound. <gasps> I'm getting scared at nothing. Oh gosh, it is dark. Let's stay close to the wall. Um. Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? Yes, there he is. Dillian, there he is, finally. You found him. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? Just wait there. I'll find you. Where are we? She has no idea. Well, I'm lighting torches. I feel very Hansel and Gretel about it. How do we know it's not him? We haven't really done anything. Another one. Ba -ba 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 -da. Another one. Please fill up a cup. Don't mess around. Oh no. What's up with our vision? This is not good. It sounds like somebody is dangerous. That voice. It's not Dillian. Well, that's nice, isn't it? That's just lovely. Well, now it sounds like a cow. Quite literally. Ooh, what is that red corridor? Obviously, I want to run down there, but let's check out over here first because maybe I don't have it. Oh, gosh. Yeah, they're going to make me go that way, aren't they? Let's go towards the weird bull sounding creature that's gonna give me a heart attack and I'm gonna get scared even though I know something scary is about to happen because I'm a chicken. Uh, sorry, the look of it reminds me of in Home Alone, the thing that Kevin's scared of or whatever. Oh. Her face pain is gone. Again. Father. 
was gonna say her face looked cleaner too. I'm leaving. Look at the I quivering in her jaw. I think it will be good. And the way she said it when she was talking. It's the darkness. It's speaking through. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it in my own way. I knew it was him. This bastard. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. We. I called it. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. We. I knew it was this abusive. No boy is going to save you. I mean, like, I agree with that sentiment no on its own, but I disagree with the second sentiment. You need to when learn to heal yourself. No. Inside you. no. They will turn their back on you. I hate being right about this. I. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. Classic abusive garbage. You need me. You can't function without no. me. You will not defy the Come, child. Take my hand. Come. Send my hand. I am leaving! Good. You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands. That was trippy. Wow. It's done. You did it, but there's more. Genuine question, and I don't mean to sound snarky or uh, dismissive, but okay, so there's like this generic noise that always plays in games and movies and stuff when you approach a mystical object. What is that noise? What instrument makes it? Is it that thing where you like, eh, and then you like do that to a rim of a glass? Because I'm 76% sure that that's what it is. Like, listen to that. That's that glass noise where you do the thing. I swear to God. Prop. No, I, I don't know. Feels like it, though, right? I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. It was so oh, terrible it was that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. Well, that's not The sickness great. took nearly every person younger than 40 and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they came out of the womb. I'm sure that's based on some sort of real historical play, because there were a bunch of those. What a fun time to live in. Something low. Where are we? Oh, I there we go. Like it. This place feels. It what is this place? This place feels. It's creepy. <laughs> it feels weird for them to say the word creepy. Wrong. Like creepy it's feels like creepy. such a modern term. You know what I mean? Like, oh, this is so creepy. Where are we? Like. It would almost throw, like, Stop. it's almost like you're like, oh, this, this place is wrong. sketch. This is a sketchy place. Stinks. Uh, it's disgusting. It smells like death. Uh, it doesn't look that bad. I can't breathe. Well, luckily, I, I don't breathe. have to smell it. It's Jesus Christ. Breath. Guys, I gotta just plug your nose. The light. Go towards it. He's in the house. Find him. Don't let go again. He's disappearing. Follow him. Well, don't obviously, that's what I'm doing. It smells like Where's death. it gone? Keep going. Test. Like the old warrior trials. Dillian will help me. Huh. I feel like stench of rot. I was gonna say that these water graphics could be slightly better, but taste it. Do you smell it? Oh no. don't worry. Not everyone can. It was a warm spring day when she went to the river with Dillian and the others. Well, the that's... water. She could taste the rot. But no one else could. She knew something was wrong. Something sinister. She begged them to leave, but they just laughed at her. But soon enough, as the bodies piled up, no one was laughing. And they knew that she was not like that. 
Well, hopefully they started to trust her sense of intuition. But that is some nasty stuff. Ugh, and the, oh, the idea of like being able to taste the rot. No, gotta stay, okay, that's fine. Let's just stay in the stink water place. That's so much fun. I do love stink water bogs. It's where I personally, if I could hang, if I, you know, had my choice of places to hang out, it would clearly be a body infested stink water bog. Just get out of the water. It's not nice. It's not optimal. Sinwa, just pick up your foot two inches. Two inches is all you have to do to get your stu literally just pick up your foot. Look at Senwa. Senwa, you amazing, strong, beautiful warrior lady. Pick your knees up. God damn it. Come on, girl. Ugh. All right. Ooh, nope, not all right. Not great. Not as good as it could be, probably. Senwa. Come to me. I'm trying. Where are you? Mom, I'm here. I'm right here. No. You have to find him. Come out if you want. They're coming for me! This is super unsettling. It's close. Run! Run now! Run! It's not safe here! Run! You don't run! Have your sword! Okay, well, here's the thing. Uh, shite. Oh my god, oh my god. Well, first of all, I would, I would like to say that a, that a sword can't protect us from a fire if anyone... I mean, like, okay, I get it. I'm dying, I'm dying. I get it. I'm losing, I'm not doing a good job, and I'm really... Ah, I don't know. Let's get out of here, I guess. Um, I would like to say your sword is not, not gonna protect you against, uh... Not gonna protect you against the fire, fun fact. Here's the thing, Senwa, like I love you and you're amazing, oh shit. Oh my God, you're amazing and you're like so strong and beautiful and fantastic, but a sword isn't gonna, isn't gonna do that much against the fire. It's not gonna do much against fire. In fact, pretty sure fire has like, it's like double powerful against steel type moves. I'm sure, steel type Pokemon, I guess. I'm trying to remember. Okay, I don't know. We're so running. Can you hear him? Well, thanks. Oh, shite. Nope. My bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. First of all, you barely ran through the fire. That was like you barely. Hey, she stopped dropping and rolling. That's literally how you get rid of fire, is all I'm saying. We did everything right, except for I did directly run into a fire. But it's like. Oh, no. I forgot about that. Oh, no. I've been doing so well without dying recently. Okay. Great, we found it. Let's go. Oh my god. Stop! Please! Stop it with the screaming! Ah! No, I didn't! Oh my god, oh my god! Oh! I'm trying! Go under! Under! I'm trying to go under! She's literally not on fire! You're fine, girl! I would like to say, she was literally fine. Oh God, it's growing. Okay, well, I would, mm, that one, I mean like a lot of, yes, a lot of things are my fault. This, this one in particular, she was not on fire and it's not my fault that she forgot how to roll under doors when I was in fact pressing all of the buttons. Good to know that the fire has eyeballs. Oh, not that way. Okay, cool. No, I mean, it's fine. I'm not anxious at all. And I'm not mad about the fact that we died when we weren't even on fire. Go, 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 go. Um, I would like to say that this, even though it's very disorienting and making me dizzy, this does a great job of showing, what? Mm, that's frustrating. Uh, I would like to say that this game, oh shit. That effect that is making me dizzy does a great job of uh, sort of showing what it looks like when you are straight, like right by a fire and it's kind of wavy. 
you can like see the heat coming off of the fire and sometimes it makes your vision a little bit wavy. That is a pretty good visual representation of that. Okay, all right, we're okay, you're okay, we're okay, we're fine. Everything is cool and good. Oh shit, nope, no, everything is bad. Everything is bad and wrong. Damn it! This is like the third time I've died in this one spot. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna kill Senwa. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill Senwa. Oh, it's all the way up her arm. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. None of the battles have even killed me this often, but it's close. getting away from this stupid fire does. Shit. We're dead. It got us. I would like to say, it has killed me twice without me. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, uh, double crap. And who are these people who are whispering that we killed them? <gasps> Dillion! Oh, okay, bye Dillion. See you later, alligator. You know what, crocodile? Apparently that's my voice for Dillion now. Oh shoot, I forgot to disable a uh, steam overlay. Good thing that fire can't burn through wood, said Ma. Oh, we're young again. Shano! Shano! What happened? They're blaming me for the plague. Oh, that's... They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? It's like gay people cause a... Uh... they know such a thing? What is it? The people... They gay this? people cause the weather or no, cause hurricanes? A... They're just people. Good people, but they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. Like children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. That doesn't make them true. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let them see who you really are, like I am. You're not a monster. That's it? Without you, the darkness has made me a monster. Oh, the veins are pulsing. What if this is pointless. What if you're wrong? What if, wrong? What if we're wrong? Oh, the good. <laughs> Look at her arm. The end. It's just a trick. It's just a pointless test. I'm so sorry, Senma. I'm so sorry. You don't know. It's just their game for you. You never know which way it's going to go. And we're going to end our video there. Comment below, let me know what you thought about this video, and also, which of the trials was your favorite? Uh, I can tell you what my least favorite part was. Uh, that was definitely, definitely the sentient fire chasing us. Okay, I might be a little bit biased because I died so many times. And yes, some of those deaths were my fault, but, but not all of them were, okay? Not all of them. Stand by that. Even though, when I'm going back and editing this, I'll probably see that. They were all my fault. Also, don't forget to comment below with your ideas for AKA intros, and I might use yours in a future video. Thank you to Elizabeth Bennett, who submitted the idea I used for this one. Admittedly, I was cut off earlier, but I refuse to be ignored. I command you to like this video and subscribe to this channel. I mean, like, if you want to. I mean, you must. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm gonna have the next video out very, very soon, so I will see you then.